In today's video, I'm taking a road trip to pick up one of the biggest seal collections I've ever gotten, as well as visit the biggest card store in the United States. What's up guys, we're headed to Louisville, Kentucky to pick up a massive sealed Yu-Gi-Oh collection. This is gonna be pretty insane. It's one of the biggest collections I picked up in regarding sealed stuff. So we're on our way there. I totally forgot to record a clip before we left. So Chelsea's helping me out on the way there. So check out ruxin34.com. There's gonna be some amazing new stuff on there and we will continue in just a minute. We're here at Through the Decades, the collectible market. We're meeting up with a guy uh, outside of here because you're not allowed to in there to purchase a collection. But we're also gonna check out the massive store while we're here. Let's go. This is a very big place. Hello, D. Hello, B. Oh, look at this anniversary pack. That's pretty sick. I wonder how much they want for that. A lot of IOC. Nice selection of newer stuff and some older stuff. Flacker's mat. Got all a bunch of singles. I found the graded stuff. For Chef. I think that's an ulti. PSA 9. Access code. Shooting Star actually way cheaper than I thought it was. It's, it's only like 75 bucks for a 9. It's kind of crazy. Uh, I don't know what they're asking, but that's not bad. Get your game on. World Championship promo. Dad, anything older? Not too much. Alright, we are here in Louisville making a deal with Jim <coughs> No Limit Gaming met us. He's from Ohio, right? Ohio, from Tennessee. We met in the middle. Here's some of the stuff we got, which basically, we're not gonna go over through everything right now, but as you can see, there's a lot of old stuff. We've got some, I think this is tin. Is that what this is? I don't know. Yeah, we can pull out. You don't have to pull out too much, but there's a lot of stuff that we are obtaining at the moment. Yeah, so stuff like this, older tins, collector tins. It's a little cold out here too. Cyber Dragon, we got Neos, Raviel, I mean, all kinds of stuff from 2006. So it's pretty awesome. Anything you want to say before we uh, cut off? Before we get cold. Uh, yeah, big fan of the channel. Whatever you need to do. Uh, big fan of video. Uh, we're actually here in front of the little car shop uh, through the decades. Amazing store. Huge. I've never seen a local game shop this big. Shout out to everyone at NLG. You know, my local community is amazing. We have Yu-Gi-Oh! three times a week, 30, 40 players, and uh, it's just, we couldn't do it without you guys. I appreciate you coming out and meeting me as well, so it's been great. Uh, we will cut back to where it's not so cold at some point, uh, so thanks again, man. Sure. All right, I hope you guys are enjoying a little bit of a different video, somewhat of a vlog, big collection purchase. I think you guys will like it, but shout out to Jim at No Limit Gaming because not only did he, you know, sell us this stuff and the store at No Limit Gaming was a big part of like the video and everything, but they also gave us a giveaway and it's a pretty good one. Ancient Sanctuary, original sealed packs, original Invasion of Chaos. All this stuff is in the giveaway. This was specifically uh, handed to me by Jim. He said, hey, I got a giveaway for you. So five awesome packs. To enter that giveaway, just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications and make sure in the comments you let me know what you like the most out of this collection and make sure to shout out Jim and No Limit Gaming. If you're from Ohio and you've never been there, go check it out. It's actually a pretty big store. I didn't actually go today. You guys saw the one I went to, which was even bigger, insane, but theirs is actually pretty big as well. So go check it out. Sports cards and jerseys, RIP digs, wrong jersey, Houston Texans, Jalen Green. Hey, he's been hot recently. Go Got a whole gaming section over here as well. Not that trading cards isn't gaming, but yeah, the Game Boy, Game Boy Color games, that's where it's at. That's my wheelhouse right there. Oh, look, Yu Gi Oh! Which game is this? Eternal Duel of Soul. It's sad that we have to say PlayStation 2 is vintage. That's us. We are vintage. Everyone watching this video, we're old. Sorry guys, it's just the packs. Just superhero stuff. Lorcana, the new hottest TCG. Never opened it, impossible to get, so maybe I should get some. Star Wars, that's a new thing. New Star Wars TCG, probably the 50th one ever. One Piece though. That's big. The Pokemon, can't leave it out. Watch Pokemon cards. Look at all this stuff. That is a lot of cards right there. Got a magic section, we won't go too in detail, but a lot of magic over there. One more look at this crazy spot. This thing, apparently one of the biggest stores in the country, maybe the biggest by square footage. 
So pretty cool to see as a side mission to acquiring this collection. Oh, it's Jells. All right, so we are leaving the store. Really cool, like massive. They had different Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, Magic. I picked up this blister because you guys know I love third-party Yu-Gi-Oh blisters. It has three Legacy of Darkness packs in it. Plus, we picked up all that stuff back there. You guys saw that. We'll go through it when we get back to the studio and kind of show you guys everything I got. But right now, we got to go eat. So I'm hungry. See you guys later. All right, now that we're back, let's go through some of the stuff a little bit closer. Some of it is going to be too big. Like Before we try to go through everything like on the desk, here's what everything's looking like. So 2006 tens. This is an open case. So there's 12 tens in there that are sealed. This is a sealed case. So there's 12 tens in there that are sealed, but this is also sealed. Then there is, I think this is 2004. Yeah, 2004 tens. That one's open. So 12 tens in there. Then a box of a bunch of other stuff like decks and stuff like that and then all the boxes. So we're gonna go through and look at some of the stuff up close and personal, but this is the giant tower of stuff that we bought. It's very, very expensive. So if you guys want some of the stuff, if you want anything opened up, et cetera, for on a, a video or something, check out ruxin34.com and make sure you email me after you do that. But very cool. One of our biggest sealed purchases ever in terms of just quantity and stuff like that. So very cool. This this thing attends, I mean, we kind of showed you guys, but it, oh, I kind of showed in the vlog. So I won't go through this, but like Raviel tins, Neos tins. It's a very large box, doesn't really fit there. So we're gonna skip through the tin part. So just know that there are 2004 and 2006 tins. If you haven't seen those, very cool. And if you do want a old tin or like a box even or something like that open on the channel, check out Ruxin 34.com you guys can buy it there and then make sure you email me saying that you want it open like right away don't wait like a day or anything because i might ship it like early sometimes people will wait a few hours and i've already shipped it so if you buy something and you want it to be open make sure you email me and let me know and i'll be glad to open any of this stuff for you guys because it'll be super fun videos uh if you don't want it open that's totally fine just don't send me an email and i'll sh i'll ship it sealed so uh, a lot of cool stuff a lot of awesome stuff ruxon34.com in here are a bunch of starter decks here's the giveaway that you've already seen in the video but let's pull that out then we have like full starter decks so it's like not just one starter deck but it's like 10 starter decks so if you're looking for like zombie madness or whatever it's is that zombie madness that's zombie world zombie madness i think this is dinosaurs roar we got lord of the storm and these are first ed first ed first ed starter deck first ed on the zombie world i think these are first ed yeah first ed structure deck and then these are actually really funny uh dual masters so i don't really know much about dual masters but uh epic dragons of hyper chaos we have two of these dual masters theme decks so that's pretty cool so a lot of theme deck starter deck kind of stuff pretty interesting right as of right now it'll be for sale in like these boxes but who knows maybe i'll split them up at some point who knows i'm not totally sure what we're gonna do with these yet okay here we have a pretty cool item which you guys have seen on the channel before we have a starter deck Yugi and a starter deck Kaiba sealed case of decks. So this is an unlimited version. First eds of these are really crazy, but this is unlimited. So inside is five unlimited Yugi, five unlimited Kaiba decks. Very hard to show because they're, it's huge, but original logo, like these are the classic decks you remember. Here, I'll hold up right here. I mean, just like really amazing stuff right there. An absolutely awesome item. I did have one of these at one point, you guys remember. And uh, I think I ended up opening it, selling the decks. It's pretty cool to have one of these again, because these you do not see very often. They're normally opened as individual decks at that point. Then we also have a first edition starter deck Yugi Evolution. So this is an evolution version. This has like uh, the Blackluster Soldier one, as well as the uh, Kaiser Glider, no, not Kaiser Glider, Kaiser Seahorse on the front of Kaiba. And an interesting thing about this one is it looked like this was displayed because it's super sun faded on this side, but it's really cool because I mean, these come in unlimited as well. So getting first ed is pretty cool. Uh, when I first pulled this out for a second, I thought they... I thought this was a first ed Yugi and Kaiba. And I was like, whoa, I did not remember that when like we were doing the purchase, but no, it's first ed of evolution. And I was like, okay, I freaked out for a little bit. Evolution, that makes more sense. This is still really nice though, and a really solid item. And I kind of already showed this earlier, but here's the blister I bought um, at the other store. What was the other store called? The huge one. You guys saw it at the beginning. I already forgot the name. I've been driving a lot today. So I'm like, oh, by the end. So I'm kind of like turning into mush. Now we're into more of the sealed like boxes stuff. So we have Pharaonic Guardian. This is an unlimited 24 pack very cool unlimited pg i'm about to have a lot of unlimited i have ioc still i have lod from that other video now we have pharaonic guardian so we are really building up those unlimited boxes that's pretty cool and speaking of if you guys already forgot or maybe you haven't even seen it yet maybe this is the first video mfc first had an unlimited box break coming this thursday or maybe like this is saturday i don't know next thursday whatever the 11th it's going to be pretty amazing i'm super excited so click that link down below get 15 dollars free credit on whatnot so go check that out it's gonna be super super fun dark magician girl giveaway as well for one of you guys 
prize for free. All you got to do is be there. All right, the next items, I'm not sure if I've ever had these. I don't know if I've opened this either. Probably have, but I can't remember. Dark Revelation 1. This is a very old box. Look how big it is. Looks like a 36 pack box. It's a 24 pack box, but 13 cards per pack. Very nice looking box, actually. So I'm thinking because I haven't opened this in either ever or in a long time, we might do a box break because I have not only one, but two of these. So one of these might be box break time for all you YouTube members and Patreon members. Go check that out. We've almost sold out of our current one. And by the time you see this video, we might already be sold out. So if you want to get first dibs on that and uh, have discounts on all the all those make sure you check out uh the youtube membership down below click the join button or go to patreon.com slash 34 whatever it is it's the link in the description oh there's more non-box stuff i should probably have done these already and these are pretty iconic it only cost me 11.99 to buy these as you can see 11.99 for starter deck yugi that's how much they cost not really that is how much they cost back in 2002 probably so starter deck Yugi, starter deck Yugi. If you want to get a place at a dark magician. Oh, wait, that would take three. Oh, that's because we have a third one. The legendary dark magician, beautiful play set of those. So that's pretty awesome. I mean, you can never go wrong with starter deck Yugi or Kaiba. They're absolutely classic. Did someone say starter deck Kaiba? Oh, of course, of course we did. Because here they are, not first eds. I mean, it'd be pretty crazy if they were, but unlimited still, I mean, very expensive because these are getting hard to find. $11.99 is how much they cost. That's right, I paid $11.99. Just kidding, this was a very expensive collection, guys. This was insane. This was definitely the most I've spent on a sealed collection by far. I'm trying to think what the most I've ever spent on a collection is. This could have been it, to be honest. I'm not sure. And I'm not counting like consignments because that's like I sell it for them. I don't like pay for it. This was not a consignment. This was like I bought this. This was uh, this was money right here. So we have oh, unlimited Pharaoh servant add to the unlimited collection. Not really. I'm not collecting unlimited, but I do have them available on my website. Very cool. Though. I mean, man, you guys haven't heard about my story about unlimited Pharaoh servant a long time ago. I once bought an unlimited Pharaoh server. It was gonna be like only my second old box ever. Ended up getting a first ed by accident. So I contact the person, hey, like, ooh, didn't mean to get this. So like, it was a $200 box and the one, first ed was 800. So I was like, uh, you gave me the wrong box by accident. Cause they, we bought a bunch and then like, they accidentally sent one of them first ed. They were like, oh, well, how about you just pay me 100, 150 extra or 125, something like that. I was like, all right, I'm in. So we did that. So that was really cool. That was quite a long time ago. I think it was 2018. So good time sometimes you get lucky and then if you're just a nice person about it you know tell them that they made a mistake they might let you get it for cheap anyway so you could argue hey but you could have just kept it for 200 yeah but then you'd feel like crap so guess what i got the best of both worlds let's go and speaking of unlimited oh man we're adding to the lod collection lod unlimited i now have three of these so if you are interested in lod booster box i have several of them now at this point that we are adding them up unlimiteds very cool. I have like half the unlimited boxes now from these two purchases. And that's not all. We got another unlimited Flamey Eternity, which we will be opening soon for a box break in first ed. Here's an unlimited version. I don't know. Okay, so this number is between retail and hobby. So that means it's a hobby unlimited. Is that what this means? Because 103024 is hobby first ed. 103030 is retail first ed. So I'm assuming that retail first step would be maybe something like one or retail unlimited would be a 103033, maybe something like that. Or some, I don't know. So somebody that's an expert, I could I really could just look. Gezi sent me all the info. If I look right now, I can figure it out. But you know, it's like to guess sometimes. All right, two more items that you guys have not seen. One is a first edition Labyrinth of Nightmare 36 pack box. So this is a pretty dope box. I mean, Magic Cylinder is awesome, Secret Rare. It has 36 packs of Labyrinth of Nightmare, which is a fan favorite. It's a really awesome one. I really like the purple on it. I'm just a fan of this set in general. I mean, Blast Warrior from another planet. Who can go wrong? Masker Strike, it's pretty cool. Not my favorite cover card, but Dark Necrofear, yeah, heck yeah. So first edition, had a lot of Unlimited. There's a first ed. Here's another first ed to end it off. And this is a fan favorite right here. Pharaoh's Servant, 24 pack. You know what that means? Genzo. Genzo time. Could be a Genzo in here. There's a Gear Freed right there. Could be a Genzo inside of this box. Or a Thousand Eyes Restrict, which would also be amazing. Or a Buster Blader, which would also be amazing. It's not the perfect condition, but this is an amazing item. Look, overall, we pull 
Well, we didn't pull anything. We haven't opened anything, but overall, we've gotten a lot of amazing stuff in this pickup. And it was fun to actually like go on a little road trip and check out that awesome card shop that we visited. That place was massive. I could not believe how cool it was. So getting to go out and do that today was actually really fun. A lot of times I'm just at home, you know, doing my thing. So get a little road trip out there, a little mini vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you did, make sure to subscribe and make sure to check out No Limit Gaming if you live in the area. And don't forget to check out Ruxin34.com and of course our whatnot link for our upcoming stream. Shout out to Toe and Fo Show, Puffet Zudum, Ernesto Dan, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Another Side Show, Ian Moose, Jr. Barney, Robert F., Thomas McLean, Chang Lang, and Aldelso Galicia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.